and we are now in the gaming hall of uh, Gen Con. Um, the, this actually is some of the places I like the most because there's independent companies that can't really afford booths. Actually, these guys do have a booth, but they come and uh, demo the game and, and get in touch with the gamers uh, on a more personal basis. And uh, I kind of like that, and I think they should be uh, they should be looked at more often. Uh, this is one of those uh, type of uh, company which is for, uh, Break from Reality, and this is their game uh, Damage Report. And here I have Jonathan, who's going to be giving us a quick overview of Damage Report. How are you having a good time at the console for? I'm having a great time, though most of it's been teaching this game to people. So that's good. No, that's good news, man. So uh, for more people who want to uh, learn the game, can you teach us again? <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, I can. I can at least give you guys a brief overview. Of the take a little bit longer than this to teach the okay. game, but basically this is a real-time cooperative game. So. There is a set amount of time. So if I tell you that this scenario is going to take you 30 minutes... It's going to take you real time 30 minutes. At most. Uh, if you're right. really good, you're going to win. Right. And right. Uh, it's not going to take you all 30 minutes. But if you uh, get your butt handed to you, which happens, happens more <laughs> often than not in these games, because it's not... A, it's. I'm not going to say it's an easy game, because right. it's not. Yeah. It's, it's going to be difficult, okay, which, cool. which we as gamers love. So this is a real-time cooperative game. So what you will be doing is you will have a character here, and your character will progress along, being able okay. to take their actions. They're able to pick up stuff and move it along and you know ferry it along so that other people can do their pairs. Right. They can do an investigate action where they're able to see what actually needs to be done okay. for a repair. Okay. And then they're able to... Do the repair. They put the they put on the metal plates, the microchips. All they these things that yep, are needed. Yep. To so repair. they utilize the tools. Right. After the repair is done, the relevant system goes up. Whatever. This, this is this is a, a, yeah. a spaceship, right? Yes. That's yep. uh, in trouble. Yeah. Uh, hence, damage report. Yep. Right. It's a you know classic sci-fi. The you know evidently they just don't make spaceship engines like they used. Like to, they used. To. You know. Right. So, very very you cool. know, So they're all they. It's just the hyperdrive is constantly on the fringe. Okay. And, and now so I see these here. So when basically yeah. um, when you take an action, these. Yes. So so let's just say my actions just ended. Right. I get to the life support level my ship is at determines where I get to go. And that this that's this year. Yes. Okay. So right now the game starts off with it on yellow. So it flips over to the yellow. It. The sand timers all go 15 seconds. Right. 15 seconds elapses, and then it gets then you can go flipped back onto there. the green. Oh, okay, so that's After how you the calculate 15. the time. Okay, yep. very cool. Yeah, and so, and it's really nice because it, it it requires people paying attention to themselves and not just being well. You're going to go over there. And you're going to go over yeah, there. Yeah. And you, you 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 got your job to do. Yeah, you you have, you have your job to do, right. and they have their jobs to do, and. You're gonna talk a lot. You're, there's gonna be a lot of yelling, but it's never like it's never the it's never that alpha gamer yelling where they're telling you exactly what to do. It's right, like, right. It's like I need the blowtorch over here. Get the blowtorch over here, please. I need some gems. Get me yeah, some yeah. gems. I think that I think that's what attracted me to this game is that uh, uh, I usually don't like co-ops because of the alpha gamer element, and and this is uh, uh, removes that aspect from it. Yeah, and, and, and what's really nice about it is that every one of the players does have those nice, unique sets of skills, and and if you know what you're doing, you yeah, can you really get these skills working for you well. Now, it, th there's like 10 scenarios, correct? Yeah. Okay. And, and, and at least while we're at the con here and, you know, at the future cons, if you ever come to one of the conventions right. that we're at, uh, we have... Uh, some promotional scenarios as well. Oh, very uh, cool. Very we have a great one right now called Problems with Puffballs. Okay. That, uh, yeah, the, I, I saw them there, those, those little puffballs there. Yeah, yeah and those and cool. those will fill up your ship, and so you have to uh, you have to get them into the teleporter or the airlock. Yeah, so the, the, those, those Star Trek, uh, yeah. what are they called? I, I, Tribbles. Tribbles, thank yep. you. That's tribbles right. are a copyright of Paramount. <laughs> and so we have We are not using balls. Tribbles, it's Puffballs. <laughs> yes, Puffballs. All right, cool. Yeah. And now so, this game comes with all these components? Yep. Um, yep. Nice. Modular board, so, you know, right. the, every every these board moves. setup is different. Comes with uh, the timer itself. Yep, timer itself. This timer is great. It goes off every three minutes. When it goes off... Uh, you just flip over one of the cards, and the card tells you what horrific stuff is going to happen to your right, ship. Then your oxygen level. Yeah, you have your oxygen, oxygen levels go down. Your cargo bag is destroyed. Your shields get 
gun up, right. your corridors get breached and you oh can't go through them easily gosh. anymore. You have to go around and yeah. stuff. It's, this looks really fun. Uh, it is. Hopefully, we can get you guys a review copy of uh, Damage Report. Uh, we'll play it out, and as usual, we'll give you our pros and cons. Uh, this is a game that uh, we would uh, love to bring to you guys uh, on reviews. Hey, thanks a lot, John. Thank you. And enjoy the rest of the con, all right? Thank you. You as well. Thank you.